I hope you don't mind, guys. But I'm going to try to not edit this video and keep it as original as possible because it's just a little sweet memory of my mom. But yeah, I'm going, I'm, I'm hanging up the corridor, y'all. I don't care. So we just left my friend Kenny's, and so I'm uh, going out of his longer driveway, and then we're going to fork off here to the left, and out through here. There's uh, their, their neighbors. Let them go on anyway. Because uh, the holler goes on up that way. Now I'll turn left here. I'm still hanging up the car door trying to get it as steady as I can. Now that little uh, drive to the right, you can see almost a road almost. I'm trying to film it, but that's the family cemetery on top of that mountain. And coming up here is where uh, my half-brother lived. His name was Eddie. And that's his mom's home up right on the right. He come, uh, he come back home to take care of her. And I'll show you something neat that he built by with his own hands. And uh, there's a there's going to be a little place there with a porch on it. He built that with his own hands. That was his little place to have, you know, privacy. Have ladies over. He was single. He was divorced and intrude uh, on his mom's, you know, land. Yeah. And that yeah. coming is my great aunt's home. I'd love to. Been there for a few years. Won't you pull in there, man? And uh, we're going to my great granny's. So we're going to park. My my aunt and uncle, they, well, my aunt was the uh, postmaster there for the community. Uh, I don't know if you can see it or not, but uh, anyways, uh, oh. she ran a post office. My great-grandparents run a store. <laughs> I'd like to video all around it. This is my great great grandma's house. I remember coming up here, she wore a bonnet. I can't go that around that way. Nobody's lived in it for God forever. We're gonna go in it. Oh wow. It's still got the floor, mommy. The hardwood floor. I'd love to have this wood if they ever tore it down. My granny lived in here. That's great. Well, I told him it's my great great. And this was the kitchen she had. It's been many years since anybody lived in this old place. What's the kids wrote on there? Oh, hang me. <laughs> oh, yeah, Fred. <laughs> Here's some of my kin folk. That's my little cousin, hang me. I'm still on that mission, and that's where my Aunt Murdy lived. Her name was Murdy Hill. I meant Grandma. My Aunt Garnet lived there, too, on the next door. But the outside of this old place seems to be in pretty good shape here still. Well, what happened to the windows and stuff? Pretty sure I remember TJ and Eddie and Amy. That's the old back door. <laughs> That's the old smokehouse, and this was my Aunt Garnet Hill. Garnet and Ron. I accidentally shut my camera off. I have to start again. Yeah, she kept her. Okay, tell me what she did in this. What closet was this, Mommy? That was clothes. Oh. And the other pantry over there was feet. Or pants Look stuff. at the old... Uh, you better wash these washers. Oh, well, that's all right. Look. See it? Oh, oh. <laughs> and, and over here was what? That was the food. Hmm. Well, she kept her food and I guess papered it with newspaper. Yeah. No, there's a there's a Eve up in there, too. You know, this house... This was... Uh, you was four years old when she died. Can you remember? Yeah, Lord, yeah, I can remember. A lot more uh, than it seemed like. I remember her wearing bonnets. We used to take and uh, we used to take and, and walk in the yard. 
and go look at all of her flowers all the time. That's what she would do. But you look how this siding is lasted. This old siding here. This old house has lasted a long time. Now the home you see on the right side of the, of the video is exactly where my old house used to sit. Thanks for joining.